Welcome back to my channel if you're not welcome. So today's the day. Um, I didn't really talk much about it. I did apartment hunting one time and I didn't record when I did the next time. But I found my apartment and today is moving day. Uh, my eyes is kinda like all over the place. I do have a lazy eye, but that's not why. Like I'm not focused, I guess. <laughs> so I'm in my car. Um, I, well, it's 823. I should put my watch on so I can return. Well, it's not 823, it's like 816 because my clock is fast. But I'm in my car and I'm about to go all the way to Houston to uh, give me a new car. Um, this is very inconvenient for me. Because it's the only day I could do it and it's the day I move in because I did just come from out of town and before I went out of town I guess somebody got my card information and thank God they waited until I got back in town to use my card and thank God that um, my stepmom had gave me some money on my cash app so I had some money on my cash app card so if it wasn't for my stepmom um, I really don't know how I got my car at the parking lot because I didn't even know that my car was messed up. So yeah, now I'm about to go get my cart. Then I have to, I'm gonna ask for a checkbook because now in my new apartment, it's like the way I pay my rent is not the same as I did here. So it's like a fee and I'm not paying a fee. I'm not, so if I do it online, so I'm just gonna get a checkbook or I'll just have to get money orders every month. I don't wanna do all that. So I'm gonna see if I get a checkbook as well, get my new card and then I have to go get my keys and I'm gonna do an empty apartment tour. It'll be a separate video. Most likely it went up before this video. So, cause I wanna get up tonight. But this video probably won't go up until tomorrow cause I'm gonna have to add so many clips but that one just gonna be rare, um, edited, uncut, boom in your face type of thing. So, yeah. I got me some water out the house because I'm a little thirsty. And yeah, I didn't pack everything yet. Everything is basically packed, but not everything. Like my bathroom isn't packed, my kitchen is already packed. And there's still like some crap in my room. I didn't even let my iron board down. Like I'm just all out of there. But I tell you, so I'll see y'all once I get to my apartment and I'm gonna try to clean up before I start moving stuff in there. Like at least vacuum. Cause it's mostly, nothing's really gonna be in my living room yet. So I'm trying to vacuum at least. And I'll see y'all when we get to my place. So I'm back and I'm even more upset than I was earlier. So I go to the bank, well credit union, and I'm like, um, you know, I'm here to get my card or whatever. Like I gotta get a card and um I also want to know if I get a checkbook. They're like, oh, it's gonna be thirty five dollars for a checkbook and you're gonna get it in seven to ten days. Yeah, so I thought, never mind, I don't want it. Um, can I get a money order? Yeah. Uh usually they'll charge you two dollars, but I'm not gonna charge you okay and <laughs> what is your point like for future references that was it it won't be no future references i don't want a money order from here i'm only getting it today because y'all told me oh and by the way your car's not gonna work until tomorrow so what was the point like why is it not gonna work till tomorrow that's very very stupid um and then I look on the car. Why is my middle name on my car? That's first of all, that is very unsafe. I do not want my first, middle, and last name on my car. And he's like, Well, our new system, like, it just does that. Sir, why did you get a new system then? Because I don't want, first of all, the problem was fraud. Somebody didn't stole my card information, but yet you still sit up here and give me a car with my first middle and last name on it so next time they try to fraud or whatever happened um i wonder what's gonna happen this time they might just steal my whole identity you never know so i really just don't want to bank with these people anymore again it is a credit union and it's only in houston so it's very inconvenient for me first of all and i just need a bank a bank that I can trust because I don't trust them because they for one hold my check instead of giving it to me when they're supposed to 
I'm really just over it. Um, as soon as I can get my money to transfer it to another bank, I'm going to do that. I'll probably go look at banks today if I have time. Or at least another credit union that's going to actually give me my money when I need my money. Like, bills are not due on the 5th, sir. They're due on the 1st. Or ma'am, whoever in charge of this credit union. Like, y'all are ridiculous. Like, this was supposed to be a happy vlog. Like, I'm supposed to be moving all this stuff, but... No. And then I should have got my internet... My, not my internet my um cable cut on yesterday not cable my electricity cut on yesterday because i just thought about like i'm gonna go here and i'm not gonna be in a vacuum because i don't think they came and cut my um stuff on yet so i being inconvenienced to myself um yeah so today is just a bit annoying and then like my gps got me driving on this street I don't know what street this is. FM 1960, something like that. It got me driving on here, and it's so many stoplights, and it's like I was getting stopped at every stoplight on my way here. I don't want to drive over here. I want to get on the freeway. I don't want to drive on this high highway. Uh, I don't know what it is. It's not even a highway, cause gosh, it say high like it's by kind of like Highway Six, I guess. If you know Highway Six is, then you know what I'm talking about. But it's not a highway. Like it got lights on there. Like why are you calling it a highway? I don't know. Maybe that's my definition of highway, but I could have sworn it was. So I'm just very, 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 very irritated because I had to drive all the way here just to get a free car. Then a car is not even going to work until tomorrow. Like, I have a life. I have stuff to do. Like, good thing I did get the money order here. Good thing he did tell me it's not going to work until tomorrow because I came here, got the car. Still not able to use the car and try to go get my money order and I couldn't because the car don't work. I just started to say, just give me all my money on my account. Just give it all to me because I don't want to come back here no more. I'm just very upset. And I know so many more things could go wrong today. And they probably are. Like, I'm just really prepared to have an emotional breakdown as I always do. And just go back to my old apartment and just lay in my bed and cry because something bad is probably gonna happen and um, y'all gonna see this vlog because I already know I can't depend on people for anything that's why I don't really do that anymore so yeah send help thank you we put an update I already have paid my first couple days of rent I shouldn't even did that before I even looked at the apartment that they told me I was gonna move into but me trusting what they said I thought it's gonna be nice I go in there, the carpet stained, the ceiling messed up, the paint uneven, it looked horrible, the floors was dirty, I saw a roach, bro. So, they're like, oh, well, we don't have another one, Bill, baby girl, I don't know what you're gonna do. So, then they call me back. This is just an update, I'm talking fast because I'm about to go in here, but she's like, oh, we got one we can show you right now. So, all of a sudden, y'all got one available because you know I'm finna go in on you. But, yeah, so, I'm looking, I'm about to go look at the other one. Hopefully, it don't look disgusting, like... They up in there having parties and putting hot Cheetos on their fingers and rubbing them on the wall. But I'm gonna let y'all know how this can go. Let me go back again. It's gonna be like, um, title, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I don't know where I'm gonna move. So, update. Um, most of the stuff is downstairs. I still ain't moved in anything yet. Um, I don't remember where I left off at. I don't know if I told you I got a better apartment now. They all of a sudden found one. I think I was on my way there when I told y'all, but it really is really nice, much better. <sighs> I have to go like sweep and stuff and try to film the empty apartment tour. This is just a lot, this is so stressful. I never wanna move again in my life, but of course I'm going to, but once I find me a house with like six bedrooms, I think I'm done moving because I don't like the process. Maybe get updates, renovations, but other than that, I'm not moving all the time. Like, that's so annoying. What is this on my arm? Like, I see something. So, I'm not going on. What is this on my lens? It's not coming off. <sighs> my goodness. My camera has a dot on it. And it's, like, not coming off. Wow. 
You see that dot right here? What am I gonna do? Like, if it's not one thing, it's another. It's nothing on the camera because it won't come off and I wipe. And I don't see anything. Maybe it's broke. What am I gonna do with that again? You know, we're gonna turn off and try again because maybe it's on my screen. I don't know, but. So I'm at Marshall's and I'm shopping for my apartment. Um, I really, I saw a mirror at Walmart. It was really nice. But I think I'm putting my living room and I think I'll put this one. Cause I did just break my mirror. I think I'll put this in my beauty room. It's like a, I think this matches my vanity really well. I don't really know. I think it do. It's like a cuter type of thing. So I think I'm gonna come back and get the mirror. It's only $40, so it's a good deal. I think I'm gonna come back and get this. I'm not gonna get it today because, or I might come get it tomorrow, but because I'd rather take it right to my apartment and my apartment is not done, so yeah. This. this looks kinda cool, but this is only $17, but I don't know what I'll do with this. I saw a really nice chair to do nails, like for them to sit in, but it was $100, like no. This will look really, this is only $25. It's really nice, but it don't really match anything. Um, I did want an accent chair, but I don't know what colors I want to do yet. So I'm just really looking for like bathroom stuff right now. Um, I don't really need anything for my kitchen. I mostly just need bathroom stuff. I do want to get a new um, laundry basket, but I think I want a wood laundry basket or like a, um, what is it called? Be bamboo? Babu? Bamboo. Bamboo. <laughs> um, laundry basket. So, yeah, I do need a shoe rack as well. They have these really cute aprons in here, but that's not something I need right now, so I'm not going to get it. What's this shoe thing and it's blue? I don't like that. But they have these like really cute aprons. But I don't wear aprons when I cook. So that could be like a house warming gift, I guess. Um I don't need any candles. I have some candles still. I really did want to put some plants. I see some plants here on clearance. And they're just fake plants. Like, I see this one here. This just makes it nice. It's only $6. But, $7. See, I'm so tempted to get coffee mugs because I really love coffee mugs. I think I'm doing really good filming. What do y'all think? How much is this one? I don't see the price. This one I have a price, so. This one here, I don't really like the pot, and it doesn't have a price either. Oh, $13, it's not bad, but I don't like it. This one's only $6, I really don't like that one, so no. Um, oh, the plants are over in that house, so yeah. Um, this is really cool, but it's like not a color that I was looking for. And they have like some really nice wine glasses. Oh, they have some more um, hangers. Ten dollars for twenty hangers on. Hmm. This one is perfect. I could put um, my keys and my mail. It's hard to grab stuff on here. 
but it's twelve dollars. So I could put like mail and stuff in here. Well, that's what I would put in. Well, I don't know. I kind of want one that like hangs up by the door. This you can't really hang this up. So. making my mouth taste funny okay they have some really nice pictures here oh i saw this picture online i thought about getting it and it's only 17 dollars here and it was so much more online so i might just grab it where i'm gonna put it i don't know um i like this for my makeup room but it's really small so i don't know It's like a pink one back here. Oh, it's just lipstick. This is a cool one. Mine is. I like this one a lot. It's a 17. I don't know what color I want to do my bathroom, but I think I want to put that in my bathroom. But I really like this one. Mm, but I don't know where I put it. Cause right now my living room is just like um, gray. But I do want to. I don't want it to stay gray. I do want to make it um, gold in here. But I really like the one of the girl. And because it was more expensive, I like, I might just grab it. I don't really know what to do. Like, I don't want to be here spending a lot of money. This one is actually really nice too. But I don't know where I will put this stuff. Like, I don't know. Mm. Almost knocked that down, but. Mm. I really don't know. I guess it'd be better if I knew what I wanted to do. Okay, I really like this. To put like, I don't know. This, what's back here? Oh, that is really cute. I don't care, I'm getting that one. I don't know where it's gonna go, but I'm getting it anyway. How much it is? This is really a hustle. If it's $16, I'm going to give it $16.99. This is so pretty. And it has like the pink background. I might put this in my beauty room. I don't know what color I want to do in my beauty room, but I want this in it. So I have to have it. It's so, so pretty. There's some more lashes on there, but my vanity is like a silver color, so I don't know if I really want any gold in there. But I know she has that black on her, it's like really pretty. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Um, I don't It's like something behind this one. It's two. Okay. Um, this one, this one, I guess it's another one of those ones. So since I'm going to get this one, I'm not going to get that one. Or the other one I saw. That one down there. Mmm. Oh, it's something behind this one though. Oh, I don't, I don't want that. It's a lion or a tiger or something. I don't want that. But I think I want this one. For my bathroom. Mmm. I shouldn't have got it, but I am. Like, I mean, it's not like I shouldn't have, but I should have got what I came here for first. But I don't really care. I don't know where I'm going to put it, though. Um, 
now. Pillows. I'm gonna need pillows. I need a shower curtain and some clips as well. I have like these white shower curtains. I don't like that. One. I have white already. I'm not gonna get a shower mat because I've had a shower mat. I do need like a, a shower caddy thing that does not rust at all. So I see this one's worst proof, no rust. And some of these don't say anything at all. So I need the ones that are like rust proof. How much is this one? $15. Let me, ow, my senior stuck. I need to see if the other one is cheaper than that one. My thing is gonna overheat. I've been on here for 10 minutes. So I'm not really tripping about it. But it always does and I'm kind of sick of it. But is that the same? I really like the black. But this one is 14 I don't remember how much other one is. I think they're the same price. Yeah. It's just what I like more, I guess. They basically look the same. See, they look the same. This one's like kind of a darker finish, but it's not to where it's noticeable. I think I'm gonna just go ahead and get that one because I like the V on here maybe. I don't know. <laughs> that one actually looks a little smaller. I'm gonna just go ahead and get this one. I'm gonna put the picture at the bottom. It looks like somebody kind of messed this up. So, so pretty. Like, I just love this picture so much. And I just love the black glitter. Like, it's just so pretty. And no one can tell me otherwise. What? Well, tell me what y'all think about it. But I really think it's cool how you got the soda can. Like, I think this is so pretty for the beauty room. Um, okay, this is exactly what I was looking for. They have a pink toilet bowl brush. And it's $8. But I really wanted pink. And it's um, like this pink. Let me get it. Oh, wait, this one is a little different. But which one is cheaper? It was the same price. Let me just get this one. I saw a uh, um, pink like bathroom like soap in, I think I had a trash can at Walmart. So I'm gonna get it from there. You can only need the soap in the trash can because I'm gonna do that in my downstairs bathroom. But I have a trash can here for $20. I'm not buying it. It's cute, but not I'm not paying too much for it. Mmm. I have these clear with the $13. No. How much is this? So I could do marble in my bathroom. This is $10 for my bathroom. How much is this stuff I don't know. This is $10. And they have another one. Um, it has like the... Because I could put the toothbrush holder in here, I guess. I really don't know what I want. I'm going to look at the... um. The what's up pictures first? Well, I don't know if I want to do this pink because I really wanted to do the um, Tiffany blue color. So I don't know. How big is this rug? Thirteen dollars. It's a little big. Um, okay, I'm gonna get off here because I've been on here for a minute and I'm just gonna look to see what I want and then I'll come back once I figure out. Hey y'all, so as you can see, I'm still at my old apartment. I still have this spot on my screen. I don't know what it is. Um, you don't care to know that much, but whatever. So 
Just got back home. I went to Ross, Marshalls. Dang. This piece is from my um, rod is stuck on the wall. Ouch. Great. Um, I went to Marshalls, Ross, and Walmart to get stuff for my bathrooms. So they're pretty much completed. Um. What is wrong with the settings? Like, I don't even know. It's like really. Okay, I fixed the settings. That's probably why that dot is in the camera. I don't even know. But I had to fix the setting. So, yeah, I went there. That was my bathroom. Then I went to Sonic to get some food. So here's my food. As you can see, I'm sitting on my bed because the person was supposed to help me with my bed and not help me. I'm really not shocked. You know, when people always let you down, you know, you know, you don't depend on them anyway. So, my mom helped me. That's it. That's all that matters. Um... I don't know, like, the person who's supposed to help me said they'll help me tomorrow, like, they fell asleep, and, like, that's what they told me. So, we'll see if they help me tomorrow. If not, I always have a backup plan, so, you know. I'm just disappointed, but not surprised. It's like been a really, really, really long day. I've like just been really all over the place. I'm just so thankful for my mom. Because it was for her. I was laying in this room all day with that stuff packed and not doing nothing. I really probably even got packed. I don't want to do that. I'm probably on like 7%. I want to watch some YouTube. I left my um laptop at the new place. Um yeah. And the new place is getting um like bombed, exterminated, whatever. I feel like it's very important to do that whenever you move anywhere. Cause you don't know who lived there for you. So yeah, I'm gonna find some watching YouTube. Um, I'm watching right now. I'm getting here, and I'm gonna take a nap. So, I will say I should have tomorrow, but I'm not. <laughs> so. I still have to head over to the other apartment again tonight to clean the bathrooms and probably bathroom and stuff like that. Probably, really won't be tonight, probably like three in the morning. I gotta wait for that bomb to go like that. So I'm gonna, if I do, I'll show y'all. So this is probably not the end of the vlog, but this is the end of right now, so. I'll show y'all later. Okay. One thing I forgot to say. You got me sleep on these grape slushies from um, Sonic. It's like Kool Aid. It's so good. Like, mm. I'm becoming obsessed with like grape flavors. But yeah, I'll see y'all later. Uh, as y'all can see, this is what it looks like when you move to the Like, I'm in my car with all this stuff. Okay, it's not a lot of stuff. Because the bigger stuff got to get moved later. Um, obviously, I got on the same shirt. Obviously, it is the next day. It is 6 o'clock in the morning. I took a two-hour nap. Or, okay, maybe I overdid it. I did like a four-hour nap. And then I got up and was washing and packing more. I didn't took everything out of my room and took it out to the room. Like, yesterday I was being lazy. I don't know why. I think I was just kind of irritated. 
but I didn't move so much stuff downstairs. Like the only thing upstairs is my box screen and my um, headboard. Like I've moved everything else downstairs. Oop, it said do not enter and I entered anyway. Oopsie, already breaking the rules I see. Um, It was kind of too late because I was already about to turn and I missed my turn, so yeah. Now I'm at my apartment and I'm about to unload this car and go in here and clean up. And then around 8.30, I'm gonna go back to my apartment and um, I'm going to uh, pack like my mattress and all the other stuff that's really big that has to go on a truck, so yeah. Well, I'm going to clean these bathrooms, mop my floors. This is going to be so fun. Good thing I have my beats peel. I hope it's charged. But, yeah. Um, I'll see y'all once I get moved in or once I start moving big stuff. I don't know. I'll probably record while I'm cleaning up. But, oh, another thing. I decided that I think I'm going. <laughs> I've decided that I think. I think that I'm going to start filming on my phone again because my camera is acting really crazy. Like, the spot seems to be going... Yeah, I think the spots, no, the spots still there. Definitely still there, but I, um, the camera overheats really bad, and it's just very annoying, and I don't have time to do with that, so I either have to buy a new battery. Well, the camera already overheats fast anyway, even when I'm, like, when I first got it. So that's one thing I don't like about this camera. Like, I used to love this camera, but now I'm, I don't know, so I probably... I have a new camera. I've had this camera for maybe, I don't know, two years. So yeah, I don't really want to get a new camera because I like the function and how small it is, but it's just, it's not the best camera. So uh, yeah, but that'll be in a later date. So I'm gonna see how um, the quality is on my phone. And then I'll probably start using my phone. It looks a little different, like, let me show you. Well, it looks, I don't know, it's kind of a big difference. I don't know how I'm supposed to, yeah, you can kind of see the quality of it, so. I really don't know, but let me go from here. <laughs> I broke so many rules, like, I went through one way, I went through a do not answer, like, Hectic. Um, yeah, um, it feel like day two moving. I pretty much put up everything that was in the living room, mostly except for like my sheets and stuff. But as you can see over here, I put my TV and my nail stuff is like put away <coughs> over here. So yeah, then I have like my piano, and I have my stool right here. I was sitting on it. Um, my toilet is running a lot, so I have to make sure that you can fix that. Um, I have my stuff up in the kitchen. I have my cabinets open. Still, I didn't do anything in here yet. Um. Again, the toilet is still running, but I have like my little stuff up here. I have this little rug, and I have a toilet bowl cleaner over there. It's so cute, but yeah. So I guess I was doing like a bluish kind of thing down here. I didn't want to do pink in both bathrooms. I wanted to do like Tiffany thing, but I have this picture. I don't know if I showed you this picture today, but I'm gonna put this picture. So it's really cute. I could hang it up right now, but whatever. Let me turn these lights off because I'm not coming back down here. I was gonna come back downstairs, but I'm gonna be back to just go to bed. So, I'm turning the TV off. I really like this setup that I did. It's so cute. Then I'm putting my couch over there. One second, my couch. I don't want to leave my couch. 
I know what couch I want, but I think I'm gonna look, go to this furniture store, cause they have like really good deals. So I'm gonna go to the furniture store and look at what they have. Oh, okay, let me turn this lamp off. And then we're gonna head upstairs. See, this light is so dim. I'm glad I got that lamp again. You see, it made a big difference. Um, this is a mess in here, but that's my beauty room. And I have my picture here that goes in my bathroom. My bathroom, I put my shower curtain up. Black shower curtain, black rugs. And then I have my pink accents. I got a pink toilet bowl cleaner over there. Um, I have my tissue thing right here, but I'm gonna put that downstairs and I'm gonna buy one with the toilet roll thing on there because this one doesn't have toilet roll thing here. My lips are so dry. Um, so I'm gonna put that picture in here and I'm gonna put these up. Um, I think I'm gonna put them like right here because this is a big empty space and I don't wanna put it up there, so I'll put it right there. I think that look really nice. Like, I had to take a shower and everything, so kinda is a little messy. I still have to clean under the cabinets and stuff. Um, I mopped and everything, so yeah. I could edit videos around. I don't know where my laptop is. <laughs> uh, maybe I should try to find it. I think it's in here. Yeah, it's in here. It's in my bag. Um, I have this up there. I don't know. I think I'm putting. Well, I am gonna put that in my beauty room. But I don't know what else I'm gonna put in here. I feel like that picture would look really good in here, but I wanted my bathroom instead, so. Because I was able to bring that black into it. Like, I'm really happy about that. This was a mess, you know, my lips hurt. They that dry that they hurt. I just seen it doing some nails not too long ago. So, yeah. Now I can get some rest. I didn't get any rest today. I hope this looks good in the bathroom. I feel like it will. Yeah, it's gonna look so good in here. So fucking. That's just like the best picture I've ever seen in my life. But yeah. That is pretty much it for the moving vlog at this point because I moved in. Now all I gotta do is unpack. So yeah. That completes this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. And I'll see you in my next video. Make sure you give it a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe. Bye, y'all. So. It's morning and well, it's 12 o'clock, but this still is pretty early for me to wake up, if you know me. I've been waking up really early since I've been living by myself, and I'm really happy about living by myself. But uh, I hate these apartments. Like, this management is so ridiculous. Like, it's gonna be a long journey. Like, I like the apartment itself. Like, I like the painting, I like the wood floors. Like, it's it could be a very nice apartment if the people not to keep up with their apartment. Like, they don't. Like, the management sucks. It's so, like, it's not a lot of stuff wrong with this apartment, but I need new I need new thermostat. They need to come clean out this little closet with this little thing inside of it. My toilet keep running. I already told them that. Like, if my water bill is up, it's because of them. Like, come fix the toilet. My sink is messed up. Come fix my sink. Like... I'm already irritated living here, and I should not be, like, this is just ridiculous. Like, when you first move to your apartment, your apartment should be great, put together. They should have did a walkthrough, everything. Because when you leave, they should going to make sure that it's put together. Well, I would hope so. Obviously, before the person left here, it wasn't put together. Like, I honestly feel like they weren't done renovating it. But because the other apartment was not up to par, they moved me into this one. But that one wasn't done renovated either. Like, there goes my toilet running downstairs like this is just a lot i didn't think it would be this hard to be moving to an apartment but obviously it is so 
I'm just trying to be patient, trying to work with them. Like, I'm not about to call you every day and tell you to do your job. Like, I'm not. This is just. I'm going to just relax, okay? <laughs> but yeah, this is the end of the vlog for real. I just had to come on here and do a little rant before I end my video. Tell how I like living in my apartment so far. This was my second night in my apartment, so yeah. Again, give it a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.